You know what's even more satisfying than arresting a criminal? Seeing them rot in a cell. Right. So, Bentior won't actually tell me anything without legal pressure. Bentior wants legal pressure. <laughs> well, I think we can certainly accommodate him there. Take... This. A letter with my signature. Show it to him and he's sure to change his tune. Well, that was easier than I thought. There's something else. Protect and serve. It's what we do. Right. So, you know that man running around with the, um... Bone to pick with a restful watchman. Oh, oh, this should be interesting. Go ahead. Let's listen. Yeah, I have his memory gem. Well, this should be good. All right. Talk to you. I'm not exactly excited about what we're about to hear. I don't know what it is, but let's find out. How do I activate this? What's that oh. snot-brained Alder That's doing how. here? This is no place for one of them. You don't think he's Thalmor, do you? No, doesn't seem the sort. But he's still not the right type for our little den. Might bring the wrong kind of attention. So what do we do? Stabbing him would be... excessive, so... I know. Why don't we treat him to a little show of our favorite lusty Argonian maid? Oh dear. Perfect. Let's go fetch her. Here, take this coin. I'd like to buy a little show for my Altmer friend over there. Sure thing. Oh, one other thing. He wanted you to roleplay as Lifser Tail, you know, from... Ha! <laughs> Altmer. Always the same fantasy. Sure thing. Hey, darling. I heard you wanted a date with Lifser Tail. What is the meaning of this? Lifser Tail? <laughs> What a ridiculous name for an even more ridiculous- Oh my! Zarxus's breath! What an oblivion are you doing? I demand that you put that back on! <laughs> Ariel, give me strength! Cease and desist! I demand that you cease and desist at once, you cretinous lizard woman! Stop an inn? jiggling Go about! The view. There's another tavern in town, the restful I can't Watchmen, take this anymore! I think I'm going to faint! Well, I think- bad reputation. Oh. Well deserved. Ha! <laughs> it worked! Otis, you really are a genius. <laughs> I know. Sop didn't even know what hit him. Ha! <laughs> they breed him special in Alinor, don't they? Well, that's certainly very... interesting. But I'm not sure that there's much in there that I can take action on. Really? Tell our Altmer friend that I'm very sorry. Will do. Alright, that was, um... Not at all what I was expecting. Right then, um, I've had a very different experience with High Elves. Frankly, um... Rizada the Resplendent, Enchanter Extraordinaire, Illusionist right Incredible, Restorer Remarkable and Destructor. Frankly, not every Altmer dreams of lusty Argonian maids. Now where is... What was his name? Salandil something. Eleanor types, huh? Right. Um. Well, I don't find the High Elf in here, but, um. I do have a letter. For Bentior. Hello! How are you? You here to do business? I am! I have a letter from Adius, actually. Here you go. What? Let me see that. Oh. Damn. Fine. I'll tell you what I know. Listen, I heard the thief had some dealings with some, uh, fellow businessmen holed up in the Geralds. You'd probably call them bandits, though. I tell you, no respect for the profession these days. Here, just so I don't have to go sit in a cell again, I'll mark it on your map. Go take it up with them. And by the divines, leave me alone now, alright? God. I'd be happy to. Bye. Yes, bye. Well then, that was easier than I thought it was going to be. I probably could have skipped the whole ordeal with the memory gem. Poor bastard probably actually fainted. Ancient Nordic ornaments, weapons, armor, you My name it. Is this uh... a... Yeah, I mean, huh, no. Respect the law. Respect yourself. 
Okay, let's go find that elf. Alternatively, where did that man mark on my map? Who knows? I don't hear... I don't hear that Ultma's whining from a mile away. I wonder where he ran off to. Huh. Hello. Stranger, have you seen my dad? Oh, we just talked to you. And no. Right. Um. Hmm. Nope, not him. Yes, traveler. What do you need? Um, I'm looking for a high elf actually. Sorry. What if he's in here? What can I get you? Oh, hello. You're that girl's mother, aren't you? Good afternoon. Ah, there he is. Hello. You're back. Have you played back the memory gems recording for the captain? When is he arresting that damnable innkeeper? Well, he can't actually press charges against him. Zarxus's backside. I'm leaving this awful town. Did you change the I've had enough of this like cretinous Cyrodiil. I'm returning to Alador. At least the there I'm not assailed by lustful lizards. Right. Well, that? good luck to you then. It was the linens. Have fun with that. It the bath. It, uh, it hey, old traveler. Okay. Hello. I, I'm you sorry, love. Uh, the just remember, so a life full of adventure is stress. the only yeah. life worth living. So, uh, you're an adventurer then? Well, I would be, but unfortunately, I've got some debts to pay off. I've been doing odd jobs around town to help raise the septums. One of these days, though, take a vacation. To the highlands, perhaps. Goodbye. Not really my business, actually. Okay. So. Gerald's are cold this time of year. And every time of year. <laughs> Yes, I imagine so. Alright, so... Elf dealt with. I still need potions if I'm going to be going dealing with bandits. We're so close to Skyrim. I'm surprised the war hasn't spilled down here yet. Right. Good afternoon. Um... Do you know where that little girl's father is? Haran. That elf. Oh. oh, did Lysinia send you my way? Forget I said that. No. I haven't heard from him in months. Not since he was called to arms. Ah, uh, that's what I expected to hear. Until next time. Right. You know, growing up an Imperial and hearing about a war in... in Skyrim. It's a bit like hearing your neighbors having bad luck with their husband. The restful watchman. Rooms and food, that's what we do. What do you need? I actually want to tell you that Sarandil left. No charges can be brought against you on that. Ah, uh, that's good to hear. Thank you. Here, take a little bit of coin on the house. Oh. Oh, and have this. It's a leftover memory gem that one of the guys took out of the elf's pocket when he was passed out on the floor. Might fetch a decent sum. Oh. Well, that's interesting. A little bit See of gold around. on the house. He actually paid me more than the guard did for turning in a Lamu. That's... Well, that's interesting. I don't really what want to know it? where that gold came from. Okay. So, bandits to deal with. I have to go investigate some nobles for that orc. Okay, so that's where he marked it, but I think... I think it's cold up here. It's getting late. I'm probably going to have to... Hello? Eh, I can... I can put up with... Actually, let's see if I can... catch the nobles before they turn in for the night. I'm not exactly used to dealing with nobles, but I guess I'll try my hand at it. I would rethink this outfit, but um, 
I don't really have anything in my pack that looks less weird. Oh, great. There's Armion again. Or one of his other goons. Hello. Bastard. Ah, uh, right. This, uh, this should be fun. Hello. I'm the Count Stewood here in Pruma. If there is anything you need, I'll try my best to help you. Right. Um, do you know of any nobles that hired mercenaries for a bandit raid last year? I'm asking for a friend. An interesting question. We keep records of expenses from members of the Bruma court, especially the times it's coming out of our treasury. However, we don't give this kind of information out to anyone who so much as asks. Why do you want to know? Um, I'm actually investigating a kidnapping with suspicions of foul play. Man's wife. You know, that kind of thing. He's rather heartbroken. Truly? Hmm. I see an honest glint in your eye. I think you are telling the truth. Well then, I will get you any information I can from the records. One moment while I go check them. You just wait around here. Will do. Although I'd rather not wait uh, in the same room as the Viscount. That just seems bizarre to me. And I don't want him to run all his way back. All this way back. Ugh. Hello, I am Afana Adichie. I'm part of the Bruma Court. Oh. Rather high ranking in it too. Anyway, is there anything you needed? No, I'm good, thanks. That was, um... She's rather forward, notice to visitors. Be accepting visitors from 9 in the morning to 6 in the afternoon. Uh, Alright. Well, I'm glad I uh, came up here when I did then. Ah, there he is. Well, I've checked the records. There was one account of a fa- Hello. Uh, right. What'd you find? Well, I've checked the records. There was one account of Afana Idiji hiring some mercenaries for a job similar to your description last year. She spent a lot of time around the castle. You can go speak to her if you wish. Out of memory, there was another who hired some mercenaries for a bandit raid last year too. It was... um... Simon Cotier. Yeah, that's the one. Not too sure on the details. I'm going off of memory here, since his mission wasn't recorded in the books. Huh. Strange, that. We usually keep thorough records. Well, anyway, I hope I was of some help. But that's all I know, and all the books know. Best of luck with your investigation. A group of bandits in the county are growing bolder and are becoming a menace. The Count has put a bounty on their heads. Here, take a look at the warrant. Right. Thanks. Bye. Of course. You don't mind if I go and ask the nobles a few questions, do you? Let's see. Bounty decree. I still wonder why... Falkreath, somebody in Falkreath knows about me. Um, the Silius Carvain of County Bruma has placed an official bounty decree upon the bandits at Plump Rat Camp, where whose activities harassing travelers, mercenaries, and good citizens of County Bruma must be put to an end. Appropriate payment shall be provided to anyone who slay the bandits' ringleader. Once the deed is done, report to the castle steward. Alright. I doubt that has anything to do with the investigation, but who knows. Maybe that's the bandits that took that orc's wife. Okay, well it's a bit late, but I am running an investigation here. And Adius does owe me a favour. Well, sort of. 
They've got blades armor in that case. Where'd they get that? So... Are you... Hmm? Uh, are you Simmond Gartier by any chance? Do you know of, um... Any, uh, mercenaries hired? Um, yes. There was Strong Minds operation. That's about all I can remember, though. Huh. Alright, well, thank you for your time. Goodbye. Oh, what the heck are the Thalmor doing? Wonder what to have for dinner. In the court. I'm Sinja. Sinja Strong Mind. I'm one of the nobles of County Bruma. Um... Is there anything I can help you with? Actually, yes. Um... Can I help you? Sorry, I'm doing an investigation. I'd like to ask you, uh... What is it? If you know about any mercenaries that may have been hired for an operation? I heard of two raids on bandits in the last few months. They were... There was Operation Strong Arm, and another. The other one was Anamidas, if memory serves. But strong arm was my idea. Afraid that's all I can remember, though. Things move quickly here in the castle. Uh, who did you hire for the raid, might I ask? I hired... just some common, everyday mercenaries, really. Nothing particularly special about them, as far as I recall. Um, well, was it, uh... Where were they holed up? They were holed up in Plundered Mine, as far as I remember. More have probably moved in by now, sadly. I swear, <clears throat> bandits breed faster than skeevers in a keck of black briar. <clears throat> right. So, um, was it successful? Yes, it was. The bandits were cleared out, and the ringleader killed. Minimal casualties on her side. That's good to know. Okay, so... Until next time. That doesn't seem likely. What is it? Um, I'd actually like to ask you a few questions. Hello. Uh, same thing as her. Uh, mercenaries? Huh, let me think. There was one raid Simmond organized last I remember. Never mentioned it to me. Always been a quiet fellow. But I saw it in his journal. You, uh, were reading his journal? Well, yes. He's one of those mysterious men, you know? Just has an aura about him. Piques a lady's interest. You can't blame me for peeking in his journal, I hope. We all have our vices. Right, and, um, do you not remember the raid that Sinja Strongmind pushed for? Oh, yes, I do. Operation Strong Arm, they called it at the time. Sun's Dawn, I think? Okay, um... Do you remember when, uh, when the other raid was? Um, no, truth told. Though I imagine you could just check Simmons' journal if you wanted to do that. I obviously couldn't endorse such behavior, though. Goes without saying, I suppose. Of course. And, um, where would I find this journal? You would know, wouldn't you? In his quarters, of course. Though, you may need a key to get inside. And, um, you may want 500 septums for expenses, and I might want his journal? I may, but I'm a noble. I'm hardly a beggar. So why should I accept this expense money? Oh boy. Let's pull a move from Bentior. Because I'm just too charming to say no to? I'm afraid you may have a slightly inflated opinion of yourself. Apologies. <laughs> well, it was worth a shot. Actually, um, forget the expense money. What is it? Hmm? Uh, in regard to Sigmund's journal, Again? What is it this time? Yes, something makes me think you actually have the key. Well, maybe I do. <laughs> I'm a terrible liar. Okay, I have one. But I obviously couldn't give it to you now, could I? Unless you could always do me a favor. Of course, what 
kind of favor. Nothing illegal, I hope. Here's what we'll do. I'll give you the key to Simmons' quarters, and you can do whatever you wish. But in return, you have to leave this note in his drawer. <sighs> no need to read it. It's sentimental. Oh boy. Obviously I'll know it. Oh, fantastic. <clears throat> Here you go. I eagerly await your return. I'm sure you do. Okay, well, that explains a few things. You know, that Altma kept spooking me into thinking... Never mind. 